Hi guys, Colleen here with the new issue of Daphne's Diary. So this came a couple of days ago and I've waited to open it <laughs> so that I can do so with you. Just a wee bit with my address on it. So this is the Christmas edition and it's number seven. I get a subscription through Unique Magazines and I'll leave the link to that down below and it gets delivered um, sort of every month and a half. There's one more issue to come, there's eight a year. So let's see what the Christmas one's like. Okay. So um just beautiful artwork this is my most favorite magazine um i use it to make little um journals and the pages themselves for pages in my journal and my glue book Trying to get this in as much as possible. It is a massive magazine. I just love Christmas. It is my favourite time of year. I've got many sandwiches, although I don't like salmon, so I'd have to substitute that with something. Also use images. You can fussy cut them out and use them in your glue book, which is what I do as well. Look at that little kitten. It'll be a glue book page dedicated to him. I don't like cats, but I do love cute, any sort of cute animals. So we've got... I'll make a little village, I think. Again, you don't have to make the projects, you can just fussy cut them and use them in your glue book or your journal. We've got Christmas biscuits. This is actually my second year subscribing to Daphne's Diary. Um, I got it for my birthday last year. And then this year, again, I spent some of my birthday money on it. These would be really cute, fussy cut out. And we've got some artists, some homes. Leftovers. never actually tried any of the recipes, but they always look so good. A new year, a new you, that would make a really nice page in your journal. We've got little tabs for calendar. And Daphne's Diary does a diary of its own. You can order from their shop. Although to the UK postage is £10, so I usually wait until they have a sale and then I'll get bits and pieces and it uh, offsets the fact that you're paying £10 for postage and packaging. But the subscription is definitely worth it. You cannot buy Daphne's Diary in the shops now. In the UK, you used to be able to, but they've stopped stocking it. Pity that is stuck in the middle. Love those little bonsai trees. Just so cute. And you've got a draw, an art project or drawing project. little dog will get cut out for my glue book. 
So we're still going with the daily November glue book challenge. Um, I have lost my glue book that I made and did five or six days in. Um, I'd made one especially for the challenge and I cannot find it anywhere. So I think what I'm going to do is just go from today and do it in my A5 glue book. That's gorgeous. Um, don't know if I'll catch up, um, but I will do from today, I think. It's a little Christmas tree topper that you can make. I just love, 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 love the illustrations. Art in oysters. I've heard of that scene, tea bag art, but not oyster art. That's beautiful. Really pretty. So yes, so there's one more issue this year and then we will start off on issue one again for next year. That's the website there, but I will leave it down in the comments. That's where I get it from. Unique magazines. And a lot of the time they have an offer on where they will have it for half price, which means I think it was £23 for the year, which was half the price if you were buying it in um, the shop anyway. Okay, so we've got an outfit calendar, make and do, that's really cute. And then we've got a Christmas colouring in, and wine glasses, snowman, snowman pizza, I really love the, just love the stories in here and the, even these. If you don't want to use the whole page, you could fussy cut these little decorations out and easily use it in your journal or glue book. And then we've got post from friends, which is always nice to see. We've got four seasons for your walls. So this, let's see if I can get this off. Without too much trouble. So this is not going to fit in frame at all. Wow. That is really cute. Purple is my favourite colour. That is gorgeous. So we've got that poster. Um, collect them all. Um, so the, uh, the, we've got this one, the winter one, the other ones are coming with the other magazines, which is really cute. Glad the purple one was first though. And we've got art on shoes. I mean, even the words. That is really nice um, lettering to try, or to, and even to cut out and use in a collage. Okay, we've got some wrapping paper, really cute wrapping paper. Double sided, that's really cute, really love that. We've got a little story about the Christmas table. This is gorgeous. Um, so we've got the 12th of January. Not sure. That should be 2020 or 2021. And that was the back. So 
the front would make a lovely um, cover for a journal. I have, let me see, one that I made with a different cover. This one here. So this was a cover. Um, obviously there you can see that was the front of the cover. And then the inside picture was actually, um, I liked it better. So I made it into a, so that would have been the one there I would have used to make the cover if I didn't want to use the outside of it. So a very useful magazine, not just for reading, but for lots of cute art projects and craft projects. So if you enjoyed this video, I would really appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing, that would be even better. And I'll see you next time. Bye.